Good morning. It's Thursday, September 30th. We're glad you've joined us for another top story. And since you did, go ahead and like and subscribe below. On today's full World Watch show, we got all the news you'll need. And the whitest white paint is just plain cool. Literally. Also, it's Fat Bear Week, and we want to know which one you would crown as the World Watch champ. Now, this is Top Story. America's military leaders testified on Capitol Hill this week. The Senate Armed Services Committee grilled them about the withdrawal from Afghanistan last month that resulted in the Taliban seizing the country. They also wanted answers about an attack that killed 13 U.S. soldiers. Under questioning from Republican Senators, General Mark Milley said that he had advised both President Trump and then President Biden that a quick withdrawal could lead to the collapse of Afghanistan's government. My assessment was uh, back in the fall of 20, and it remained consistent throughout, that uh, we should keep a steady state of 2,500, and it could bounce up to 3,500, maybe something like that, uh, in order to move toward a negotiated, gated solution. General Milley also said President Biden knew his viewpoint. Did you ever present that assessment personally to President Biden? I don't discuss exactly what uh, my conversations are with the sitting president in the Oval Office, but I can tell you what my personal opinion was, and I'm okay. always candid. That contradicted what President Biden said to ABC News last month. In an interview, he denied that military commanders had recommended leaving troops in Afghanistan. But the military brass defended the withdrawal itself, saying it was a logistical success, meaning well-planned. Make sure to check out the full site at worldwatch.news. You can try out the show free for a month. And remember, whatever the news, the purpose of the Lord will stay.